Yo, what is up everybody? It's your Sarah and we are back with another video. This time we're diving into Ljubljana, Slovenia. Stunning architecture, delicious food, and a vibe that's both historic and hip. Hit that subscribe button now. We're your guide to the top things to do in Ljubljana. Castles, dragons, art, and delicious food. Grab your passports, pack your bags, and let's do this. First up, we're heading straight to the top, literally. Ljubljana Castle sits on top of Castle Hill, giving you the most insane panoramic views of the entire city. Trust me, you haven't seen Ljubljana until you've seen it from up here. Now this isn't just any castle. We're talking centuries of history dating back to the 12th century. You can explore the castle grounds, check out the museum, and bring your camera for next level photo ops. After that climb, we need some chill time. Let's head over to Tivoli Park, Ljubljana's green oasis. Tons of walking paths, gardens, and even a zoo. Lush greenery, colorful flowers, and a perfect escape. Grab a coffee, find a bench, and soak it all in. Feeling active? Plenty of options here too. Rent a bike, jog, or play frisbee. Tivoli Park is all about those good vibes. Next up, we're hitting up the Central Market, because no trip to a new city is complete without experiencing the local life. This place is a sensory overload in the best way possible. We're talking fresh produce, local cheeses, cured meats, and all sorts of Slovenian delicacies. You can find everything from honey to spices to handmade souvenirs. But the real star of the show here is the energy. Locals chatting with vendors, the smell of fresh bread baking. It's an experience you won't forget. Okay, time for some more architectural wonders. The triple bridge is exactly what it sounds like. Three bridges, side by side by side, spanning the Ljubljana River. This iconic landmark is a must-see, and it's even more impressive in person. The bridges connect the modern part of the city with the old town, so it's like stepping back in time as you cross over. Take your time, admire the details, and maybe snap a few pics for the gram. Trust me, your followers will thank you. All right, guys, get ready to meet the symbol of Ljubljana the Dragon. The Dragon Bridge is one of the most famous landmarks in the city, and for good reason. These four fierce dragon statues guarding the bridge are seriously impressive. They're said to represent power, courage, and wisdom. Legend has it that Ljubljana was founded by a Greek hero who slew a dragon, and the dragon statues are a reminder of that legend. Pretty cool, right? All right, history lovers, this one's for you. The National Museum of Slovenia is a must visit if you wanna dive deep into the country's rich past. We're talking artifacts dating back to the Roman era, medieval weapons, and exhibits on Slovenian art and culture. You could easily spend a whole day here and still not see everything. Make sure you check out the prehistoric flutes, which are some of the oldest musical instruments ever discovered. How cool is that? After all that exploring, it's time to slow things down with a relaxing boat ride on the Ljubljana River. Trust me, this is the best way to see the city from a different perspective. You'll cruise past charming bridges, colorful buildings, and leafy riverbanks. It's the perfect way to unwind and soak up the laid-back vibes of Ljubljana. Most boat tours offer commentary on the city's history and landmarks, so you can learn while you relax. Next up, we're heading to another architectural masterpiece, the Ljubljana Cathedral. This stunning Baroque cathedral is hard to miss with its iconic green dome and twin towers. Step inside, and you'll be blown away by the ornate interior with its intricate frescoes, sculptures, and stained glass windows. Even if you're not religious, you can't help but feel a sense of peace and awe in this beautiful space. All right, time to switch gears and head to the edgier side of Ljubljana, Metalkova Mesto. This former military barracks has been transformed into an autonomous cultural center, and it's like stepping into another world. We're talking colorful street art, live music venues, and a vibe that's both gritty and creative. You'll find everything from punk rock bars to art galleries to vegan cafes. If you're looking for something off the beaten path, Metalkova Mesto is a must visit. Ready for some mind-bending fun? The Museum of Illusions is a must-visit for families, couples, and anyone who loves a good optical illusion. This interactive museum will have you questioning your senses and snapping some seriously cool photos. 
you can walk on walls, shrink yourself down to miniature size, and even defy gravity. It's a fun and educational experience that will leave you wondering, how did they do that? Now, let's get lost in the charm of Ljubljana's Old Town. This historic district is a maze of cobblestone streets, colorful buildings, and hidden courtyards. You'll feel like you've stepped back in time as you wander through the narrow alleys, discovering cozy cafes, boutique shops, and historic landmarks around every corner. Make sure you have your camera ready because this place is seriously Instagram-worthy. Calling all animal lovers. The Ljubljana Zoo is home to over 1,000 animals from all over the world. You can get up close and personal with lions, elephants, monkeys, and even a few endangered species. The zoo is committed to conservation and education so you can learn all about the animals and their habitats. It's a fun and educational experience for the whole family and a great way to spend an afternoon in Ljubljana. If you're interested in learning more about Slovenian culture, the Slovenian Ethnographic Museum is a must visit. You'll find exhibits on traditional clothing, crafts, music, and customs. You can learn about the country's rural past, its folk traditions, and the everyday lives of Slovenians throughout history. It's a fascinating glimpse into a unique culture and a great way to deepen your understanding of Slovenia. Get ready for some hands-on science fun at the House of Experiments. This interactive museum is perfect for kids and adults alike, with exhibits on everything from physics to biology to psychology. You can experiment with sound waves, learn about the human body, and even create your own tornado. It's a fun and engaging way to learn about science and a great way to spend a rainy day in Ljubljana. Escape the city buzz and step into a world of tranquility at the Ljubljana Botanical Garden. This lush oasis is home to over 4,500 plant species from all over the world. You can stroll through the greenhouses, admire the colorful flower beds, or simply relax by the pond and enjoy the peace and quiet. It's a great place to escape the city noise and reconnect with nature. For a deep dive into Ljubljana's history, head to the City Museum of Ljubljana. You'll find exhibits on the city's Roman origins, its medieval past, and its development into the modern capital it is today. You can see artifacts from archaeological digs, learn about the city's famous residents, and even see a model of Ljubljana as it would have looked in the 18th century. It's a fascinating journey through time and a must visit for anyone interested in the city's rich past. For a night of culture and entertainment, check out a performance at the Ljubljana Opera House. This grand building is a sight to behold with its stunning neo-Renaissance architecture and opulent interior. You can catch operas, ballets, concerts, and other performances by world-renowned artists. Even if you don't have time for a show, it's worth taking a peek inside to admire the architecture and soak up the atmosphere. One of the best ways to experience the heart of Ljubljana is to take a stroll along the Ljubljanica River Promenade. This lively walkway is lined with cafes, restaurants, and bars, making it the perfect place to relax, people watch, and soak up the city vibes. You can grab a coffee and watch the boats go by, enjoy a delicious meal with a view, or simply wander along and enjoy the atmosphere. It's a great place to experience the laid-back charm of Ljubljana. Art lovers, rejoice! The National Gallery of Slovenia is home to an impressive collection of Slovenian art from the Middle Ages to the 20th century. You'll find masterpieces by renowned Slovenian artists, as well as works by international masters. From medieval altarpieces to impressionist landscapes to modern sculptures, there's something to inspire everyone. For a breath of fresh air and a dose of nature, head to the Ljubljana marshes, just a short trip from the city center. This vast wetland area is a haven for wildlife with over 250 bird species, as well as otters, beavers, and other animals. You can explore the marshes on foot, by bike, or even by boat. It's a great way to escape the city and experience the natural beauty of Slovenia. And there you have it, folks, the top 20 things to do in Ljubljana, Slovenia, from exploring historic castles to getting lost in charming streets to experiencing the city's vibrant culture, 
Ljubljana has something for everyone. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more travel adventures. And be sure to let me know in the comments down below what your favorite thing to do in Ljubljana is, or if you're planning a trip soon. Until next time, keep exploring.